Hi, it's Kathy with Capex Creative Cafe. I had one of my email subscribers ask me how I made the hello labels um, with my joy that I created in another blog post that I did. And so I wanted to do a tutorial on how I did that. Um, I'm going to go into shapes and click a click on the square. And I'm going to change the color of that to white. And then I'm going to go, I'm going to unlock right up here, or you can do it down here, the square, and change the size to 4.5 by 2. And then I'm going to go back to shapes and select a circle. And I'm going to change the size of that to 1.25. Change the color to white. So I'm going to choose the text feature over here on the left. And I am going to type in the word hello. Move this over here. Then I'm going to go up to style and click writing. And under operation, it'll say pen. And then I'm going to go into my font and I'm going to choose the Alexis Maddox font. It's Alexis Maddox M Array. As you can see, the letters are kind of far apart, so we're going to do the letter spacing using the lower, the bottom arrow. And then I'm going to ungroup it so I can manually move these letters around. So now I'm going to click attach and then move this over here on top of the circle and then I'm going to highlight both and go up to a line and click center horizontally. And then I'm going to go back here down to the bottom and attach again. Then I'm going to duplicate it twice. And this piece right here is just the size of the label, the cutting area that you have. So I'm just using that as a guide to know how far apart to space my labels. So I'm going to highlight all three of all three of them. Click um, on the align and click align top, and then click horizontally, whoops, I'm just going to move that over manually, um, line vertically, there we go, and then I'm going to click attach again, and then take this piece and hide it, and then I'm just going to send this to the Cricut uh, Joy, and the pen will write out the word hello, and that's how you make these labels. It's really simple. So these are the smart labels I ended up using, um, which means you don't need a mat. And this is what the hello labels look like. And you just,
peel one off here and you've got that to put on the back of an envelope or on a card or something. So yeah, I'm excited. They're fun to do. So definitely give this a try. And remember, you don't need a mat to use the smart labels on your Cricut Joy. So um, that makes it super, not that using a mat is hard, but that just, you know, it's one less step you have to do. So enjoy.